We now have the SR Steel Award for contribution in the field of infrastructure development bestowed upon a company selected by SR Steel Limited. And I'd like to request Mr. Dilip Uman, CEO and MD SR Steel India Limited, to please join our dignitaries to present this award. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the winner is JCB India Limited to join our dignitaries in presenting the last two awards of the night. May I call upon Mr. Farhad Wadia, CEO E18. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the Infrastructure Company of the Year Award. And the award for the Infrastructure Company of the Year goes to Ramkey Infrastructure Limited. Congratulations, Mr. Nagaraja. If I could request you to say a few words. It's a great privilege for me to stand here today. We are honored that Ramkey Infrastructure Limited has been recognized as the best infrastructure company of the year. Ramki is passionate about delivering its vision of being world-class infrastructure development and environment management company. We continue our tradition of innovation and we wish to, we could achieve a new milestone with every endeavor. The final award and category is the Infrastructure Leader of the Year. The jury for the Infrastructure Excellence Awards 2012 unanimously decided to honor and venerate a legend in the infrastructure sector as the Infrastructure Leader of the Year. He is a stalwart in the field of infrastructure and has contributed significantly to its development in India. The award for the Infrastructure Leader of the Year goes to Mr. A.M. Nayak. Chairman and Managing Director, Larson & Tubro Limited. Congratulations, Mr. Naik. If we could quickly drag you here for a few words. Honorable Minister, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, let me first congratulate CNBC 18 and SR for promoting these awards, which goes a long way in motivating inspiring and encouraging the whole industry. And I'm really very, very happy to see number of new companies have emerged and number of new companies have got the awards. I'm glad Larson Dubro in its own small little way does today $10 billion worth of infrastructure in the various fields we are committed to build tomorrow's India, the powerful India and the India that all of us want to see as a powerhouse of the world. Thank you. I'd like to invite Mr. Farhad Wadia, CEO E18, Division of Network 18, to make the closing remarks. It's an honor and privilege to, gather this, to address this gathering of such distinguished individuals at the conclusion of the fourth East SR Steel Infrastructure Excellence Awards. On behalf of Network 18 and our division E18, I'd like to thank all of you who have been instrumental in helping us take this event to a whole new level of extraordinary merit. At the very onset, I'd like to extend my sincere gratitude to Shri Kamalnath, Honorable Union Minister for Urban Development, Government of India, for taking time out of his busy schedule and gracing this occasion. Infrastructure development plays a key role in the, you know, for the economic growth of our country. And the main focus of this initiative over the four years, last four years, has been the exceptional, pro, you know, to recognize exceptional projects and the individuals who scripted these stories. Thank you very much. May I request you to please remain on stage, and I request all the other winners to please join us uh, with your trophies for a quick group photograph.